can in the telemarketers. Here we go. Well, uh, hello there. Who's this? Hello. So this is not a sales call. We are doing a safety survey for your community. Do you have smoke detector in your home? I did, but uh, I unplugged all the smoke detectors. And how many do you have? One or two? We have five, but they aren't working anymore. Oh, that's a very good number. And how many fire extinguishers do you have as well? We got to keep a lot of fire extinguishers around due to grandpa smoking. Okay. And in case of fire, do you have a safe place to go outside of your homes? If it's not too cold out, we'll probably just climb up on the roof. And is your smoke detector connected with the fire department, or do they just make a... What, what's is interesting is these idiots is never get that they're being he's played. never even slowing down. Yeah, he just he's keeps got going. his script. Yeah. Loud noise. In case of a fire, we have a string tied to a belt out in the yard. If anything catches on fire, Grandma just rings the dickens out of that bell. Okay, and so I just got last two confirmations. So when it came to protecting your home and your family, which one would be your main concern? Say it could be fire, burglary, or medical emergency? Uncle Bab's worried about his testicles erupting every time he falls down the stairs. So probably the medical one. Oh, uh, yeah, so that's a very wise choice. And so to complete our survey, may I just have your first name? And your name is? My name is Rufus. I'm sorry, how do you spell that? That's Rufus. It's spelled D-U-M-B. Fake. Oh, so you got a nice name. And so lastly, I would like to say, uh, for taking part in our survey today, there's a chance that you could be selected to receive a new safety system. If you are selected in future, we will let you know in evening time, okay, sir? Is there anything I could do to ensure that I win? It is not that hard to get selected, but just in case, if you are selected, we'll let you know in evening time, okay? Shh, shh, hey, hey, let me ask you something. What if I give you some money? Uh, no, so you don't have to pay anything for this. I'll make sure you'll be selected, okay? Well, I got an EBT card that you can use if you want, but I think it's almost out of money. Oh, no, sir. You don't have to do that. So, uh, hey, let me ask you something. You got any kids? Oh, no, I'm single. I haven't married yet. No kids? Don't you like naked ladies? You're not funny or something, are you? <laughs> oh, uh, I have a very busy schedule. Busy doing what? Spanking it and watching Baywatch? Uh, yeah, I, I work as well as study. Oh, you study? Well, what do you study? Uh, I'm doing my graduate. You're doing what? Karate? Graduate. Did you say Kung Fu? Uh, I'm doing a graduate. Oh, you sound Asian. You're probably studying to be a doctor. Uh, no, I'm not a, I'm not a medical student. Uh, I'm taking uh, art. Art? Oh, no. Your family must be so disappointed. What do you paint? <laughs> oh, uh, I love painting uh, human figure. Are you talking about painting naked ladies? Oh, I did privately sometimes, and I, I used to paint in, uh, in my class. So you just take these naked ladies back to your house and you paint them? And they don't have any clothes on? Oh, so you you, you like uh, hot cheeks, right? Uh, yeah, of course. We enjoy hot cheeks. Hot cheeks. I like the hot cheeks. And then, uh, and then do you have sex with them? Oh, uh, no. Not at all. Well, that might be why you don't have any kids there, Yoko. Oh, no. Yeah, maybe. I'll, be, I'll try next time. What kind of music do you listen to over there in Hong Kong when you're painting naked ladies? Oh, I love. sometimes I, lo I love listening to country. Country music? Country like who? Oh, I like John Williams. I never heard of him. He must be one of those Chinese country music stars. <laughs> Uh, okay, so actually, uh, I would okay. love to talk to you for the whole day, but thank what I need to say is thank you so much. Have a great day, and I, I enjoy talking with you. Okay, Takimoto. Talk to you soon. Okay, bye. Well, that's just so hurtful. Ken, shame on you. The guy's trying to earn his 17 cents an hour, and you're jacking with his living, his income. Uh, he's calling from Hong Kong to sell us, I don't know, some... Fire extinguishers or something here in the U.S.? Uh, well, it was not a sales call. He was right yeah. up front about that the first thing. Oh, yeah. I just wanted yeah. to know, the next guy that calls uh, will be on the sales call. Oh, yeah. understand you yeah. only have uh, two fire extinguishers at your house. That's probably not enough to really get the job done. If you, uh, you, know, if you love your family and you want to protect them. I like that. You're going to win if you enter this contest. Uh -huh. You're, next you're going to be the winner. Who is going to tell you you won, <laughs> and for a small fee. Uh, yeah, you know, you know how the rest of it yeah, goes. You know how it's, yeah, yeah, We we can hook you up. Well, All we need is a credit card number. While y'all are being busy getting silly with strangers on the phone, I was doing my work over here. Uh, well, I, I know she had your hand in your pants. Yeah, I was uh, working uh, pretty hard. 